Oh, oh, hi. Hey, how's it going? I was just outside with a Yamaha Majesty. Look at that belt. Look how big that puppy is. That's a nice belt, too. Anyway, Yamaha Majesty 400. We're at Scootertronics today. I'm Michael, also known as Scooter Mike, and around here. We're going to look at a few projects from um, the Thunder Shop and um, SRC, Scooter Racing Crew. Um, we're going to look at a lot of chrome, definitely. A few scooters. Um, first thing I want to show you, though, is uh, Scootertronics does carry lots of different exhaust bikes, but first of all, let me get back out of my street attire here. Give me one second, I'll be right back with you. Put on my trusty WPS hat. Definitely like Western Power Sports, along with uh, one of my favorites, MRP. So we're into those two. There you go, Honda Ruckus. You guys like Honda Ruckus? There's a nice black front fender for a Honda Ruckus. That comes in chrome, too. God, we, we love our chrome. We love our chrome because our customers love our chrome. So naturally, we have to do the ruckus in a chrome front fender also. So that's something you get. But really, I'm, I'm here today right now to um, talk about exhaust pipes for both two-stroke and four-stroke scooters and go-karts, which I'm just going to go ahead and let you know right off, this is a go-kart engine that's been set up at um, about 190 cc's. Um, so that's why you see this exhaust pipe on it. This is, you can tell it's not a scooter exhaust. It's actually um, the high performance 150 exhaust for go karts from, from MRP, that's Martin Racing. Which, if you're aware of Scootertronics, you know we've had a very long relationship with uh, MRP. So uh, you'll see a lot of MRP around, and we'll talk about that in a second also. Just for a special that we have going on during the holidays, is we have these uh, chrome two stroke pipes here that are best used on 50cc two-stroke scooters. Um, we actually have these for $89. So if you want to get something that you don't have and you want to add some flash, you'll find these on our website under the clearance section, which um, has uh, these chrome pipes on it, plus um, a lot of different color trunks for all types of scooters. Well, you can get your basic shad Mac matte black, Okay, which will match anything, or all the way up to your burgundy Vespa trunk. Now that's nice. If you have a Vespa, it's a really good buy on our site right now. Actually, that's way under a hundred dollars, and you you get the trunk for that. Now that's for for the Vespa um, ET2 uh, and ET4, and why it's specific to those scooters is you do get the mount. So, trunk and trunk mounting hardware for Vespa ET scooters, so ET2 and ET4, and those are 50cc and 150. Now, a couple other things I want to show you here today is um, Scootertronics does carry lots of different two-stroke exhausts. So, just to give you an explanation of it real quick, this is a Leo Vince Handmade. Okay, a handmade exhaust, easy to tell, it's always a natural color where you actually see the different welds. The, the, uh, the amount of welds is very important to the tuning of the pipe. This particular pipe here is for an Aprilia SR50. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight welds. Very good pipe, adds lots of power. You can use it for 50 or 70. If you have a 70 kit on your Aprilia SR50, you want to pop out the restrictor right here. A lot of pipes come with a restrictor for two-stroke, okay? So that's in for 50, out for 70. Now staying stay on the uh, Vespa e ET4 150, there's a Sitto high-performance pipe for an ET4 150. This, this will also fit um, the Fly 150, so you have a choice there also. Now we're going to stay with Vespa here for a second. Um, because we do do some restore on uh, Vespa scooters here at Scootertronics in uh, the Thunder Shop, which is right over here. And we'll take a look back there in a second. We got a surprise for you back there, too. So um, we actually have the next pipe I'm going to talk about. We'll actually go for this uh, this 64 Allstate, which is right here, which is this uh, Tommy, Tommy Thunder's award-winning Vespa 1964 Allstate. There you go, Charm City. Got first place there. 
in uh, Vintage, which uh, Scootertronics was a, a vendor and a sponsor of Mods vs. Rockers all over the United States. So you can be in Utah or Texas and see Scootertronics. All right, so what I want to show you about that is you have a couple choices for exhaust pipes on this for it to get the performance. You can stick with uh, the conventional stock look, which you don't actually see the exhaust too much hanging out, but it is, you can tell right now that the header is much bigger than stock, and it is performance. So it does add torque, and it does add top end. So this would be the the stock look for the, the Allstate, um, this 125, or you can get really crazy with it, and of course add chrome, because we love chrome, and we love chrome because our customers love chrome, there you go, there's a chrome high performance pipe for Vespa 1964 models, the Allstate models, I believe there's probably like three different ones, I'm not really the best on my Vespa, so just bear with me. This also fits Vespas um, in made in the 70s and 80s, I believe. So you can this one you'll see the, actually see this pipe where on most I don't know if you can really see what's going on over here, but the exhaust is underneath stock, so you don't actually see it. But adding the chrome pipe, you'll get it on the outside. So that's something that you can everybody can see, and it is louder. So if you're not wanting to wake your neighbors at 4 a.m. when you're going to work on your Vespa, stick with the black underneath. It'll be a little bit quieter. <clears throat> we'll move on to um, some 150 exhaust. Okay, this is a your basic one GY6 150 engine. It is a short case, so it's found in uh, uh, most go karts that are made will have this 150 engine in it if there are 150s. Um, so you, you're, what you're seeing here is a high performance um, exhaust for a uh, GY6 150 go-kart engine from MRP. You can already tell that the header is much bigger than stock and you have a nice sounding can that's on here. This is where the power comes from. You want to think about more air in, more air out gives you the better torque and the better power. Just go on that philosophy all the time, can't go wrong. Now, <clears throat> in scooters, you will have a long case if you have 13-inch uh, wheels or 12-inch wheels. There's a lot of retro models that have the 10 <coughs> and 12-inch wheels that use a short case. But when we're talking about exhaust pipes, short or long, exhaust pipe works on either. So if we were going to do a scooter, we would put a, a silver carbon fiber look exhaust can on it. Okay, And that would come with... Um, Of course, it comes with a chrome header. So there, you got a pretty good deal right there. Looking there, and these are on sale right now for 149. This pipe is usually 329, so that's a good buy for the holiday season. <clears throat> you can go with uh, the silver carbon fiber. You can go with a complete round stainless steel exhaust. Both excellent sound. Make your scooter sound like a Harley. No doubt about that. And. Also for the 150s, we're going to have some, uh, these are actually, a lot of people call them the big mouth or the carp exhaust, just from the, the different end that they have on it, but it is an oval design and adds a little bit more flash to your, to your scooter. Now keep in mind, when you do an exhaust, you're going to want to add more air and gas to it. So on this particular go-kart engine, We've added a cold air intake, which is the long metal tube, and then a larger k and filter. Now, on a, this, this one's actually sticking up. On a scooter, we're going to use this tube to our advantage, where it makes installation much, much easier on a scooter. Now, if you've ever messed with your air filter on your 150 scooter with your GY6 150 engine, you'll notice a bar that comes across here right near the carburetor. This solves that problem. It'll, it'll put the exhaust, the uh, intake coming out the side of the scooter, and you'll actually see it. So that's a great thing. 